Hi, my name is Pearl Cao. I'm a systems engineer for the wireless and low power charger group at Texas Instruments. Today, I will be showing you a demonstration of TI's automotive wireless power transmitter solution, BQ500 414Q. This is the BQ500 414Q transmitter evaluation module. This device is AEC Q100 qualified, WPC version 1.1 compliant with foreign object detection feature, and it supports 5 watt charging capability. It uses WPC A6 transmitter type coil. This three coil free positioning solution guarantees 70 mm by 20 mm active charging area. The receiver device does not need to be precisely aligned on the transmitter pad to be charged. This feature is seen to be very attractive and important for automotive in-vehicle charging applications. Another feature of this device is the I2C interface to host controllers, where the CAN or LIN controllers can access the BQ500 414Q device to read or write certain commands and update firmware. Through I2C commands, the host controllers can temporarily shift the transmitter operating frequency to avoid interference with smart keys. Customers have the option to use a proximity sensor to turn on or shut down the transmitter. The WPC A6 transmitter type requires stable 12 volt input. This design supports 6 volt to 16 volt input voltage range with the additional SEPIC converter. There is efficiency difference with and without the SEPIC. To improve system level EMI performance, an EMI shield is developed. It can be placed on top of the transmitter coil in between the transmitter and the receiver charging interface. Please note that the shield should be grounded in design. Over 24 dB improvement is observed with this EMI shield per 6 per 25 EMI measurement. This shield causes less than 2% efficiency loss. Overall, TI provides a system-level solution that suits the wireless charging needs in vehicle and eases the design effort for customers. Thanks for your time. For more information, please visit us at ti.com slash wirelesspower. Don't forget to ask questions and get answers at the TIE2E forums. <laughs>